Good morning, my app tribe. I hope all is well with you and yours. I also pray that your morning, evening, and or night is going accordingly as planned. It is 621, if I am not mistaken, AM here in Phoenix, Arizona, and I am still active, my tribe. Um, I guess you guys are pondering why do I have these particular jars sitting right here? Well, I will tell you. I am going to make energy catchers. Now, I'm not sure if I ever showed you guys how to make energy catchers before, but it is really easy and I learned this trick via YouTube. Um, basically, what we're going to do is take some sea salt and we're going to cover the bottom of these jars with the salt. Now, when I done this before, I just use regular sea salt. I did not use pink Himalayan sea salt. So I am itching to see how the pink Himalayan sea salt will crystallize over time. But um, yes, you guys, it's very easy. And you're going to boil some water, which I have right over here. And you're going to take that boiling water and you're going to pour it over the sea salt. And then what you're going to do is find an area within your apartment, your house, your uh, workspace, um, the gym, wherever you guys are. Uh, well, I don't suggest putting it in the gym because you're going to have to move it eventually. But um, you want to put it somewhere and leave it. Don't move it at all. So um, let's get started, you guys. Let's pour some salt in the bottom of these jars. I'm going to start off by using this pink Himalayan sea salt. I'm also going to take this pink Himalayan sea salt and sprinkle it throughout my apartment. I've been here roughly about two months and not saying that the, excuse me, not saying that the tenants whom lived here prior has really bad energies. Um, I'm not saying that at all, but I want to rid their energies and put my energies in here. So I am going to convert those particular energies of the previous uh, tenants uh, with this sea salt and leave it on the floor and in the carpet for about a week. And then I'm going to sweep it up and or vacuum the sea salt up and that will clear um, those particular energies of the previous tenants. I'm also going to take sea salt and sprinkle it in the backyard to change the energies back there as well. All right, you guys. It is sea salt time. So that should be enough, maybe a tinge more. Because I'm going to mix it with kosher salt as well. That's one. Here's two. There's three, and the last one. Okay, now we are going to add the kosher salt. And then we are going to mix the salts together. Maybe a tinge more kosher salt. Here's 
Here's another one. Here's a third one or the third one. And the idea of these energy catchers is basically to bring the sea within your home. Um, you know when you guys go to the ocean and or the sea, it's naturally cleansing. And th this is what these energy catchers, um, um, it, it has that particular feel to it, like you are at the ocean. And it naturally cleanses and um, basically uh, changes those particular energies that um, you want to uh, change and make yours. All right, third one. And we're going to mix a tinge more kosher salt. one okay so now that we have the salt in the jars we are now going to add the hot water Probably going to have to boil more water. Oh, this is going to look lovely when it crystallizes. one you guys and just fill it up I will say about right here to the um, rim of the jar just a little more water And there is our first energy catcher. So let me put this to the side and let's work on our second one. Almost done with this one, you guys. Just a 
tinge more water. Okay. There is our second energy catcher. I'm gonna move this to the side and I will be back after I fill these other two jars with hot water. One second. All right, you guys, I have all four jars filled up with hot water. And this is what the jars look like with the pink Himalayan sea salt along with the kosher salt. This is going to crystallize. Oh my gosh, I cannot wait to see if it's going to crystallize like a pinkish color or what. I am so excited. So anyway, you guys, I'm not going to set these um, any particular place as of yet. I will do that after I am done filming. Um, I want to be able to concentrate when I am doing my prayer and or ritual um, before I set these jars where I'm going to set them and allow them to crystallize. So. In the meanwhile, I'm going to take some sea salt and sprinkle it around my apartment. So join me. 